an object is at the top of a ramp at point P, the gravitational potential energy of the object at P is 100 joules. The object is released from rest at P, it travels down the ramp, the kinetic energy of the object at the bottom of the ramp is 60 joules. What is the average resistive force acting on the object as it travels down the ramp? Okay, well, if there was no resistive force, then the kinetic energy at the bottom of the ramp would be 100 joules. So the amount of work done by this resistive force has got to be the difference between the potential energy at the top and the kinetic energy at the bottom. So then it has done 40 joules of work. And the definition of work done is equal to the force multiplied by the distance moved in the direction of the force. So this resistive force is going to be acting up the ramp. And therefore, it's traveled a distance of five meters. So if we have a look, I've got my 50 joules divided through by my five meters, and that will equal my resistive force, which is going to be 10 newtons. So my answer is B.